Welcome to the Maths Made Easy tutorial on bid mass. Now bid mass is the order of operations which we use when we're performing a calculation and it's an acronym and it stands for B for brackets, I for indices or sometimes O for order uh, because we can write bid mass as bod mass, uh, it's the same thing, O would stand for order but we usually use I for indices. Then we have D, uh, D stands for division. Next, uh, we have M, so M stands for multiplication. Then we have uh, A, so A is addition. And finally, uh, we've got S for subtraction. So these are the order of operations which we use. So we always take the brackets first, then we do the indices, so that's the powers. Then we do any division, then multiplication, then addition, then subtraction. There's one other thing that we need to know though, and that's when we've got a fraction, what we do is we treat the numerator and the denominator separately, uh, and then uh, we do the division last. So uh, in this example, we've got three times four minus five over 11 plus nine divided by three in brackets. So uh, treating the numerator and the denominator separately, let's just look at the top. So uh, we've got three times four minus five. So which one do we do first? Well, multiplication, it comes before subtraction, so we do the three times four first. So that gives us 12 minus five. And then we'll look at the denominator here. And we've got 11 plus nine divided by three. So we've got brackets here. So brackets is the first part. So the bit inside the brackets is nine divided by three. So we're left with 11 plus three. So uh, now let's simplify this fraction. So we've got 12 minus five, which is seven over 11 plus three, which is 14. So uh, this is seven over 14, which we can simplify to one half. Moving on, let's have a look at an example here. So we've got an algebraic expression here. So we've got the expression four X Y times nine Y minus 13 times X Y squared. And we've got to write this expression in its simplest form. So uh, looking at the order of operations here, we've got to do this multiplication before we can do this subtraction. So uh, we can put brackets around the expression if we want. So we're left with uh, 4xy times 9y, so 4xy times 9y is equal to 36xy squared, and then we've got 13 times uh, xy squared, so 13 times xy squared is just equal to 13xy squared. So um, let's just put the minus sign back in then, so our expression is 36xy squared minus 13xy squared, 36 minus 13 is 23. So we've got 23xy squared as our final answer. If you found this video useful and you'd like to have a go at an online exam, uh, then you can do so through our revision platform. If you take the test, you'll find loads of different questions to have a go at and a variety of different question types as well, all of which will help you prepare for an exam and you get instant feedback on everything. So this is a really good way of keeping track of your progress. And if you're interested, uh, then you can click the link below and it'll take you straight over there.